Texas has long been at the center of America's quest to explore space. From mission control at the Johnson Space Center in Houston to the newer SpaceX launch site in far south Texas, state lawmakers want to keep Texas at the forefront of the space industry. Fox Wars' Alex Goyer joins us now with what could be new. Hi, Alex. Hi, Clarice. You know, Texas is really investing billions of dollars to be on the forefront of space exploration. Last season, or last session, rather, the state legislature allocated funding for the formation of the Texas Space Commission. Now NASA and SpaceX are among the industry giants who are partnering up to send astronauts back to the moon and beyond. One ignition liftoff. Texas is soaring to new heights in its quest to dominate the future of space exploration. It takes intentional investment and intentional vision to continue us down this road. NASA astronaut Reed Weissman is commanding the next Artemis mission to the moon. He testified Tuesday before the Texas House Appropriations Committee in Austin. You can't look anywhere in Texas right now and not run into space. It's amazing. Go down to Boca. Come to Houston, visit the astronauts, see Axiom, see our commercial partners. The recently formed Texas Space Commission allocated $150 million in funding to allow eligible entities to apply for grants drawn from the Space Exploration and Research Fund. You're supporting innovation, high-tech manufacturing, and frankly, doing the impossible, allowing companies like SpaceX with organizations like NASA to basically support the endeavor for humans to live on other planets and be truly a spacefaring nation. NASA once dominated the space scene in Texas, but now it's SpaceX and its founder, Elon Musk, that are charting the future. The company's president and CEO said they're launching Falcon rockets nearly every two and a half days. SpaceX is partnering with NASA to support commercial cargo flights to the International Space Station. But the company's rapid expansion has not been without controversy. Environmental groups accuse SpaceX of damaging sensitive wetlands and wildlife with their rocket operations. And there's the unusual case of Cards Against Humanity, the popular party game owned by a company that also bought land in South Texas, now suing SpaceX for $15 million on allegations of trespassing and property destruction. That wasn't addressed at the hearing. We operate the world's most active rocket development and engine test facility. And NASA's associate director, who also testified today, said that they are supporting a more aerospace missions than ever before in the agency's history. Uh, this year, NASA graduated 10 new astronauts, all of them trained in Texas. The goal to get these astronauts, obviously, into space and eventually to Mars.